Do you have good water sense? Here with tips on how we can save money while protecting the environment is water sustainability analyst with Salt River Project, Leanne Yakwell. Good morning, good to see you. Good to see you too. Let's start, what is water sense? Well, water sense is a U.S. environmental protection agency program that's designed to encourage water efficiency so we can protect our water supply. How can a product that we use qualify for water sense? Well, basically what they do is they have an open public forum where they can go ahead and have design specifications for particular products and then they allow for comment and then they go ahead and do these developments on the specifications. So for someone like me, a consumer, how do I know if a product qualifies for that? And well, it is water sense. What you can do is you can look for the water sense label, which okay. is um, right there on look for the water sense label. And what it is is these products have been third party independently tested to ensure water efficiency and they use at least 20% less water than products on the market. And are the, those are the types of products that are water sense labeled and that's why it's so important? Correct. We have all different types of products. We have toilets that are water sense labeled. So if you have a toilet that's been installed prior to 1994, you are going to want to go ahead and replace that with a water sense efficient toilet because those older toilets use about three and a half gallons to seven gallons per flush compared to a, wow. a water sense toilet that uses about 1.28 gallons. What other kind of products do you have? We also have the Rainbird Smart Controller. So what this is, is it's better than a traditional controller because what you can do is you can put different types of vegetation in here. So it's not just to set it and forget it, but you can also put specifications as far as like what type of sun, what type of vegetation it is, and how often and how much you should be watering it. And so it looks very easy it, to use. Yes, it automatically um, adjusts to the weather. Oh, wow, I had no idea. And what, are, what did you bring here? What are these? This right here is going to be the Evolve Showerhead, which uses about 1.5 gallons per minute. And the great thing about this showerhead is it's got a temperature sensor. So when the temperature of your water reaches about 98 degrees, it slows to a trickle so it's not wasting all of that hot water, which you're going to save on your utility bill as well. I had no idea, I mean, there are so many products out there that are simple to install, we can use in our home, and they make a huge difference. What other tips do you have for us? Well, um, one of the other things that you can do is, just like I said, you can do the um, smart irrigation controller, which is really important because up to 70% of your water use is outdoors. This has a rain and a weather sensor, so it automatically adjusts according to our conditions outside. So it's great and it saves you water. And you brought a friend along with you today, Wayne Drott. There's a special kind of, uh, what, he has an adventure kids contest going on. Tell me about this. Yes, if you have kids at home that are ages 5 to 12, you can go ahead and download this at our WaterUseItWisely.com website. And it's a little activity booklet all about Wayne Drop's adventures. And you can win a great prize, which is going to be the Grand Canyon Railway. Oh, that's Four beautiful. VIP tickets. What a great ride. And a great, um, a great one night stay at a deluxe room. And then we also have tons of other prizes. We have D-Bax tickets. Harkins movie theater tickets, butterfly exhibit, so lots of great things. So be sure to enter. So our kids can have fun with Wayne Drop. They would love this. Leanne, thank you so much. Thank a you. lot of great tips that make a huge difference. And if you want to learn more information, head to their website, waterusewisely.com.